overall goal of this procedure is to determine the SCC MEK type of methicillin-resistant Staphylococcus aureus, or MRSA, isolates using a multiplex PCR assay. This is accomplished by first isolating DNA from the strains using a rapid and simple extraction technique involving heating of the bacterial cells in water. The second step is to perform a multiplex PCR assay in order to amplify targets specific to each of the SCC MEK types. Next, the PCR products are separated by agarose gel electrophoresis. The final step is to stain the gel for visualization of the DNA and data analysis. Ultimately, the unique combination of specific PCR products obtained with this multiplex PCR assay is used to determine the SEC MEK types of the MRSA isolates. The main advantage of this technique over existing methods such as traditional SEC MEK typing schemes, which target individual CCR and MEK gene complexes and require multiple individual PCR tubes, is that this process greatly simplifies the workload and can be done in a single PCR tube. These procedures should be conducted in a certified Biosafety Level 2 laboratory. Appropriate personal protective equipment should be used at all times. On the day before PCR is to be done, select a single colony of MRSA from a fresh overnight plate with a sterile culture stick and prepare a heavy streak of the bacteria on a triptych soy agar plate. Multiple samples can be streaked onto a single plate. Incubate overnight at 37 degrees Celsius. Add 75 microliters of sterile distilled water to a 1.5 milliliter microcentrifuge tube. Using a sterile culture stick, pick up a small amount of bacteria from the heavy overnight streak. Swirl the bacteria in the